So today we're going to add some soil in this raised bed and we'll plant some spring onions. Here are, here's the spring onions and some parsley. So we'll, this will be the herb sites. And uh, I'll grow some cucumber as well to start with. So let's put the soil. this one the bag yeah that will cut now huh? that will cut out we won't want the other one will we uh -huh. we won't want that one in here will we the other one no oh we'll see let's just see just spread it out thing to do is 
level. moment but they will be good parsley uh, comes every every year so if you have, have this if you have if we have this now solo one the soil there and I have here here so I'll just pull it like that it has like a top road look at the row long road there I like parsley to add with my salad so I brought I planted cucumber so hopefully This was like this because uh, eaten by the slug, some of it. That's why it's not looking very good, but it will be good because it has this soil has uh, loads of nutrients or fertilizer or plant. So, done that. I'm not going to cook this. So, I have here three rows of parsley. So, let's plant the spring onions now. The two packets of spring onions. I like spring onions, so I will plant this one. Some of them will germinate, some will not. So I will plant in half. Don't grow. Eat 
these are the seats of the Springerian. I'll show you. They are so tiny. Like that. Lucky. Lucky. So one packet has four rows. Yeah. And this one is another wild kind of spring onions. Onion spring. Lisbon it says Spain. Oh Portugal. Portugal variety. It has the same seed color, black, and you do like that. One more. <laughs> Cover it like that. And top. So that the wind don't blow it. each other you just pull it put in your salad ah, isn't it good yeah so now we plant the carrot so I'll mark here this is the onion side right, I bring the onion packet Eh, carrot packet. So this is a carrot uh, packet and it's called Charisma Early Season Juicy Carrot uh, F1 Hybrid. So what I'm going to do is the same thing. I'll draw a line and then uh, spread it out. Did you see, have you seen uh, carrot seeds yet? So this one they grow like about this size and uh, this is the carrot seed I'll show you how they are so tiny also like that there you go oh doesn't show like this so draw a line I planted the carrot by the way and beetroot but they are on the ground and uh, there are risk of having carrot fly so my husband said to plant it here so that we don't need to cover it or do something or to prevent the carrot fly from coming to the carrot so one two three five I have five rows of carrot so just spread it out 
as I said, some will germinate, some will not. So we put it all. And they are very easy to be blown by the wind. Because they are so tiny. Ah, so good. Put some here, put some there. Yeah, it's like you're spreading some, uh, what do you call it, nuts. Mm. How's that? Perfect. And then same thing, cover it like that. Uh, you have to press down didn't do to the other side but I press it after yep there you go perfect carrot ah I forgot my lettuce So I got two peppers here. While do I'll put it on the side, both sides of this rice bed, and see how it will be. It will grow. This is called uh, sweet pepper. So I will put that lemon. deeper there you go because this is very very sensitive plant normally we grow it in the greenhouse but we don't have a greenhouse so maybe hopefully next year, next year we're going to buy a greenhouse so every plant that needs more heating more heat will be in the greenhouse I might plant, plant some sweet potato. Last year I planted sweet potato in the backyard, but it didn't really uh, have a lot of tubers because it's not enough sun. So the next year I'm going to plant sweet potato. Right? So done for this raised bed. Now I will plant some sunflower after I water it. I grow also sunflower and I'll show you that later. Yeah, looking good. So let's water it. Cover this for now some wood. The country is going to come here. Yeah, another one. So down the right side. Okay. Are you? Zoak it so that uh, we don't need to water for three days and after that we can water it.